but it takes almost 400,000 years until hydrogen and helium atoms can form. <coughs> now the universe has become transparent. Light from the solar can still be seen today as the cosmic background radiation. Gravity begins to pull the hydrogen and helium together. Stars are born. Fusion inside the stars forms heavy nuclei, the base of life. And these building blocks are thrown into space when stars die in giant explosions. After nine billion years, gravity pulls some of these remnants together to form our solar system with our planet Earth, where evolution gives rise to life, intelligence, and consciousness. that accelerates beams of protons to more than 99.99% of the speed of light and collides them in four interaction points. Four huge detectors take snapshots of each collision up to 600 million per second. In these collisions, Energy is transformed into particles, just like in the first fraction of a second after the Big Bang. The study of these data will soon allow us to answer some of the big questions. Will we find the reason why antimatter and matter did not destroy each other completely? Will we understand the primordial state of matter before protons and neutrons formed? Will we find the particles that make up the mysterious dark matter? Will we find the Higgs particle that is responsible for giving mass to all particles? LHC will bring us closer to an understanding of our universe.